We're out here with the SEMA X56W. It's got a 3.7800 in there. And the transmitter, you can see it's got the Wi-Fi video, so. Start that in a second. I had it running there for a second. Get out of here, B. Um, the transmitter is your normal stuff. You got the flips and the rate and the return to home and all that good stuff and the trims. These trims do do something. This one doesn't do anything. This trim right here does nothing. These here are the ones you want to use. So, And then all these buttons down here are dummies. Every one of them. None of them do anything. They're just from another transmitter. You know, they reuse these transmitters and dummy out these buttons whenever they don't want to... Uh, whenever they don't want to do anything. So let's just start the video and take it up and see what happens. This reminds me of some quadcopter that I have, uh, this foldable thing, it looks just like it. So I happened to mention that in the um, unboxing video. Let's get the raid up. Okay, it's got two. The first one's slow as molasses. Let's go with the second one. That looks a lot better. Check the uh, the all speed out. Oh yeah, that's pretty good. Let's check the flips. We'll put the flight time in there. Okay, all the flips seem to work. So that's not an issue. Oh yeah, it's spinning up nice. It's pretty nimble. Pretty nimble. Check the punch out. Oh yeah, it's pretty good. Probably a hundred feet up there. Well, it's got some decent range. I mean, how high do you want to take something like this, right? I mean, seriously. Yeah, it's pretty nimble. As long as the flight time's good. Um, as long as the battery can hang and the video don't look too bad, it's probably worth it. I think it was $39. Yeah, that's what this was, 39 bucks. Drifting a little bit. Let me see if I can get that out of there. Okay, yeah, it looks good. Yeah, flies nice. Let's not hit the fence there, Dumbo. It's nice, nice, flies nice. Nicer than the X21 and X22, I can tell you that. Yeah, it's a good flyer.
Now it's drifting a little bit the other way. It's always something. Because there's just a little touch tad wind out here. Oh yeah. Yeah, it's a good one. I like it. I'm happy with it. Yeah, it holds real steady, see? They drift a little bit, they all do. Yeah, hold nice. Looks good. Yeah, flies good, guys. Well, I'm happy with this one. It has a headless mode on it too, but I didn't. Um, I didn't try it out. I'm sure it works. See some lights flashing on there. It might be because the video's recording. Yeah, it's a nice flyer. Um, okay, let's try to return to home. Okay. <laughs> I know I shouldn't, but we'll try it, okay? I'm not going to go far. I don't want it to go to China on me. Take it up a little hair. Let's go over there. It's about 150 feet away. Okay, I hit it. Here it comes. Hey, it's coming back. It's not coming all the way back. It's coming right to there. Uh-oh. Return to... There it goes, right in a tree. Okay. See, that's what I get for fucking hitting that return to home. It always... That happens to me every damn time. Every time I fuck around with that return to home on these cheap Chinese quads, I always get this crap. Let me go fish it off the hill. All right, guys, I'm back. I saved the video, thank God. But I'm back with the SEMA.
Okay, it's still got a little bit of juice left in it, so I'm trying to get the battery. Battery light. The wind just kicked up a little bit here, guys. That's why it's uh, bopping around a little bit. It's not a big, it's not the real big wind deal here. Not very good in the wind. It's bopping around like crazy, actually. I'm just trying to run out the battery. And I think I just ran out the battery so it flew for another minute or so after the big uh the return to home failure i didn't i only had to go a couple steps up the hill it actually rolled down the hill a little bit by the time i got there so it wasn't that bad it was no damage or anything like that you know these cheap chinese quads they're they're basically indestructible. It's really hard to it's really hard to tear these things up. That's what's so nice about them. You can come out and uh, you know blow these things up, um, and you're really not going to do uh, you're really not going to do a whole lot of damage with these things. You know, you're not going to hurt anybody or uh, damage the quad hardly. You know. Uh, yeah, this thing flew pretty nice, you know, I didn't have a problem with it, so I give it a thumbs up on that It was okay